Hi everyone, welcome back to another video on my channel and in today's video I'm going to be doing another adding to my album collection. I'm really excited for this video because I did go to House of PKL which is a new K-pop store that has opened up um, recently and I went to visit because I was very excited to see what they had to offer. I had a lot of fun going around this store and this is not sponsored by the way, this is just my own personal opinion. But I did pick up a couple of albums in front of me and I thought I would just do a little adding to my K-pop collection because we haven't done one of those videos in a while and I was picking these up anyway. So let's get right into it. Let's start with this Bambi album, seems it is the oldest. So I've been wanting this album for a while and I was so happy they had this in stock. I did have a little look on their website and where's the best place to open this? Should we do it here? So I got this open. Yeah, I've been looking for this for a little while and I did have a little look at their website to see what sort of stock they had. And the prices were really reasonable as well. So here we have the Bambi album. So it has a little clear sleeve with some fishes on. It just says Bambi. This is obviously by Beckhyun. I love this album very much. And it comes with quite a few things. Should we look through the photo book first? Let me take my card out. I'm not sure where the card will be. Maybe the card isn't in this book, maybe it's in this packet over here. So here is the front, and the spine, and the back. Very excited. Here is Bakyun. So if you don't know, Bakyun is one of my biases in EXO, along with Sehun. So very excited to have this album. I love this album from start to finish. My favourite song is Cry For Love. Um, and I also love Amusement Park very pretty I love Bambi as well that's a very good title track yeah this was the last album back in release before he went to the military and obviously he's back soon which is exciting I don't know when you'll see this video so you might already be back from the military but um, if not he'll be back soon this album is very pretty I love the photo shoot Oh, this paper's shiny and then this one goes into like a matte paper. Interesting. He looks so adorable with the teddy bears. Oops. Very pretty. Shot of his face up close and his hands, okay. I love this photo. Yeah, I was really happy to have found this album. The K-pop store was really good as well, like the downstairs was a cafe and then the upstairs had all of the albums and they had a big TV and when we walked up they were playing uh, Red Lights by Stray Kids and I was like, I just had to stop and watch it for a minute before I went and had a look around. They had quite a good amount of stock as well, they had quite varied stock which was nice. But yeah, very happy to have found this. That was a little quick flip through. Obviously this album has been out for a while. Let's take a look at the first thing. So we have a poster. Very pretty. So we have this vacuum poster. I'll insert a photo at the end of the video so you can see what that looks like. Or maybe after this clip because we do have another one to unbox afterwards. And then we have another poster. Are you meant to get two? This one is another one of Beckham with the fish. Again, I'll insert a photo at the end of the video or the end of this portion of the video. And then we have this little folder. Oh, all the paws are in the front. Let me... I mean, we know it's Beckham anyway, but we want to do those last. <laughs> Let's take a look through this. So yeah, these are all the songs. So Amusement Park and Cry for Love are my two favourites. I love all the album. So we have the lyrics. And some more photos, very nice. Bambi is such a good title track, it's probably my favourite back in title track to be honest. This album in general is probably my favourite of his three solo albums. I can't wait to see what he does when he comes back from the military. I think that's going to be really fun. And then here is the CD. And it just looks like this, it just has little fishes on. Very pretty. 
happy to have this. And then we have the SM Flyer, which is just very generic. Oh, it does, it is a personalised one. It has Bambi written on it. That code's probably out of date, so I don't mind. We have this thing, which is a little, let me show you on here. A little, oh, you can't see it. <laughs> have I got something dark I can put it against? There we go. It's like a little um, Spotify kind of card, clear card, very pretty. So we have that, we have a postcard, and I got this one, super pretty, I love that. Very nice. I'm not sure where this postcard's gonna go because um, my EXO collection is in my mini A5 binder, but I will find a space for this beautiful vacuum. And then, oh, let's see this actually first. Here is a film strip, let me show you. Here is the film strip, it's again clear, very pretty. And then lastly we have the photo card and I got, oh it looks so cute! I got this one, very adorable, very happy to have him, he looks so cute, super pretty. So that was the Bambi album and let's move on to the Gasoline album. So the next album we have is Key's Gasoline album, which is the other album I purchased. This is obviously the VHS one, which is probably the coolest K-pop album I've ever seen, or one of. SM really have been doing well with their packaging recently. So we have the front, and we have the spine, and we have the back, and it literally looks and feels like a VHS. This is so heavy. Should we open it up? I'm so excited. I don't want to break it. <laughs> oh, there we go. It literally opens like a VHS. My card's in the bottom, so I'm going to carefully take that out. So I got everything random out, and we'll go through that in a minute. Let's put them there. But let's start with the photo book. So here we have the photo book. Very pretty. Here is the front and the spine and the back. It's a very thin photo book. Here we go, I'm super excited. I just love the whole concept that Key does with his solo albums, from Bad Love to this one. The packaging has just been incredible. I love that it like really looks like a sci-fi or horror type um, VHS as well. Like the style and the graphics very visually pleasing. I love the typography as well. Oh, featuring of NCT. Very nice. I honestly love this album very much. Um, the title track is really good and I just wanted to own this. So I'm definitely looking forward to checking out some of the B-side because I must admit I haven't listened to the B-sides as much as I've listened to the title track. So I'm excited to check this out properly. But yes, I do love Key. Um, I don't have a specific bias in Shiny particularly. Um, I kind of biased all of the members at some point. So yes, very nice. But this is my first time owning one of Key's solo albums. <laughs> the really hairy monster. Cool. I like his like mad scientist look. That is a mood. Yeah, I really love the packaging and the overall concept for this album. That's giving me like married to the music vibes, I'm not gonna lie. Um, very nice. Yes, it's very fitting of the concept. I love that very much. I like this photo. That's a pretty photo. I love this typography here as well. It's very pretty. The whole concept is just, he just keeps releasing really good packaged albums. I'm just loving SM at the minute with all of the album packaging. I think it's really good. And I couldn't believe I found this at the K-pop store either because it's usually out of stock everywhere. So that is the photo book. It's very thick but very thin. It's probably the thinnest photo book I've ever seen. But here is the photo book. Let's bring this back into frame. And see what else we've got inside so these look to be like postcards maybe so yeah there's some prints we have this one 
Oh, they're double sided photos. Very pretty. So there's like a black and white and then the colour. That is a cool concept. So here is the black and white. And here is the colour. And they're very glossy. And we have another one. I like this one very much. And then we have one more. Very cute. And then we have this, which I'm guessing is a poster. If it is, I will insert a photo at the end. Very cute. I love his little bits of green in his hair. I will try and insert a photo of this poster at the end. Here is the CD, which is at the very bottom. It's very pretty. And here is what it looks like close up. It looks a bit like a vinyl, not gonna lie. It's very well designed, I love that. Very cute. I'm gonna put all of this back in the album. Let me put the poster on top so I remember to take a photo of it. And then, should we see what else it came with? So firstly, we have the SM Flyer. This is just the very standard one. Oh, it is personalized, very pretty. I don't know if there's a code, I'm gonna cover that. Cause I might still be in date for me to use. Very cute, so there's the SM Flyer. Put that there. And then we have two random things. So there's a little purple packet, which I'm assuming are trading cards. He did this for his last album. Can I carefully open this without ripping it? Me wonders, hold on a second. The answer is no, so I guess I'm just going to have to peel it this way. Okay, we've peeled it. And let me see what cards are inside. So that is the little pouch. I got this purple one. I don't know if there's different ones. So these are collector's cards. So we have the first one. Wow, he looks stunning. I love this photo of him. Very pretty. And that is a green back. Let me put that one there. And then we have this, well, we have three purple ones. Are they like all dupes, do you think? We have this one, very pretty. And we have this one, super cute. And then we have, oh, there's two stuck together. We have this one and this one, very nice. So you get five cards, you get four of these like purple ones and then you get one green. So I'm guessing the green is selfies and then you get four like concept ones. These are very cool. If I'm wrong, please correct me, but that's like six photo cards in an album. That is amazing. Plus like all those postcards as well. This is definitely a good value for money. And then for the photo card I got, I got this one. I saw this on um, Instagram and I was like, this one's adorable. I hope I pull it. And I did. He looks so cute. So here is my card. Very pretty. I absolutely love how much stuff you got in this album. It was definitely worth it. Um, so I'm going to put everything back into frame and we can film the outro. So that was it for another adding to my K-pop collection, the House of PKL haul. If you did like this video, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new and want to see more K-pop related content. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, bye!